Research complete. Hello friend, my name is Pradeek Kumar. Let's start a new topic. How we can link Arduino to things to be cloud. Okay, first this is a simple project about uh, uh, like Arduino voltage sent to things to be cloud. How we can do it? Follow step by step. Okay, first you need to a hardware and that is you need to Arduino you know and a simple wire that is mail to mail okay mail to mail connector okay and you need first connect one pin to the A north and the another one is connect to ground okay first ground is mean zero okay uh, help of this we can change the voltage like this is a ground give the analog value is zero if we connect to five voltage then give the maximum value five or if you connect to three volt then give the three volt okay help of this we update from cloud okay first initially I'm connect to the ground okay this is the connection connect to your laptop okay, okay. now let's start a programming right click on here uh, come to Arduino pin it select int for initialization close for control uh, sorry this is for a close the Arduino okay come to low level and first is analog read pin because help of voltage a note we need to read the value from the hardware that's why read analog pin only okay okay now uh, come to Arduino resource connect to Arduino resource Arduino resource to Arduino resource like this the error out to error in error out to error in like this okay now select this come to this and click to vertical center okay now that's all Okay, now right click on here, come to structure, while loop, create a while loop, sorry, create a while loop like this, okay, right click on here and create a control, okay, that's all, okay, and uh, you see there have analog input pin, right click on here and create a control, okay, this is for declare the analog pin, I'm using a node, that's why value is zero, if you need, uh, if you use a1, that's you need to enter only one like this okay but now I am using zero okay this is our stop button okay now right click on here create a control this is visa this is for select a com increase it like this okay now this is done and this is the output help of this we send data from cloud things speak cloud okay now right click on here come to data communication and protocols and HTTP client and click it because help of HTTP client we send the data okay that is HTTPS okay help of this that's why uh, we are using HTTP client first open handle the another is close handle for the close the HTTP then one is get because help of the value of uh, Arduino we send the data to cloud that's why we need to get okay you can use post also from the cloud to uh, live view okay now connect client handle to client handle then client handle output to client handle input same and this is error out to error input and error out to error input like this okay all done and you see you see there have one pin that is like url okay first we need to create a url okay help of this uh, send the data okay now right click here uh, come on the string and uh, need uh, this string create here and you see there have two string right click here and create a constant same here create a constant okay okay like this like this okay okay first we need to create a account from the thing speak okay let's go and create a account okay after that we come on here okay open your chrome connect your internet okay and uh, search thing speak thing speak dot com okay so this is the first link click on here okay and you see first you need a uh, account I already create account is simple you uh, easy to create okay then come to channel click to my channel 
click here and you see I already created one uh, channel but now I'm delete this channel and create a new channel okay click to new okay now I am enter here Arduino lab view voltage this entry description voltage display 0 to 5 volt like this okay we need field one that's why click on here i already connected okay uh, now click to save channel okay you see the uh, here data is update okay first come to sharing mm, sorry uh, channel setting no 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 uh, click to api key okay api key and you see uh, they have right channel feed okay have a right channel feed and have a api key okay we need to copy all of this like first write api key control c and paste on our lab view okay and now i am in uh, paste here control v this is our big uh, api key now i am enter here a p i key okay this is our api key which you can enter okay now second one is uh, this is link this is for write because help of lab view we enter the data uh, from Arduino and then send to cloud that's why write okay now copy all this uh, this line control C and uh, minimize it and paste here like this uh, sorry delete this uh, control V okay okay done okay uh, and then again uh, open your chrome mm, okay open your chrome and uh, come to private view okay now first click to edit and you uh, change from here like 5 to 6 value as per record like i am click to 5 and if you need to title then you can easy to give i'm using love you okay then click to save okay okay now it's fully complete now come to the programming sorry come to programming control t okay now let's start a programming open this okay now first uh, we need uh, this link paste here okay you see first you need to break a link from uh, like first is http api thing dot com okay now copy this uh, how i copy because this is as like a link okay now control c and i am enter here control v like this okay okay now uh, decrease the size like this okay you see there have a uh, http from uh, thingspeak.com slash copy from this okay after link like update to field one copy in this okay now i copy this same and paste here okay okay now you see there have a same api update api key and uh, first they have a api key okay this is the api key uh, okay by default but you need to replace like percent s like this percent s replace to percent s okay and then uh, like see uh, the another means and field one this is the field one we need to data upload on here that's i already show you field one okay you need to field one if you use field two then you need to change field two if you need field three then three okay but i am using field one because i already show you uh, you see this is the field one chart okay come to channel setting and you see this is the field one okay come to field that's why i'm using and field one this is field one okay that's why i'm using here field one okay equal equal to percent 2f because i need to value float okay point two that's why i'm using percent 2f okay and i'm using the string because api key is as like a string that's why percent s okay you need to change from here to like this okay now i delete this okay now we need to uh, api key okay 
okay now right click on here come to string and you see there have a one format into string convert format into string okay and this is the format our this is our format okay then right click on here and connect to this this is our format and you see this is the input we need to enter a uh, sorry control chat we need to enter api key here okay now uh, right click on here come to string sorry come to string and you see they have a constant okay connect here and connect to this terminal okay now enter the api key this is our api key control c and now i enter here control v okay this uh, api key is different uh, as per your uh, uh, your login or uh, your account okay now all done i did this okay this is our api key this is our link or we can say format okay what already given in chrome from here i already uh, create to api key and you see this is the link okay you can copy and arrange as per your requirement okay now click private view okay okay now uh, okay you need to expand click to this and you see we need to enter a value because you see api key is enter on here percent s okay and the field one is need to any value okay and the i am using value from sensor that is uh, voltage 0 to 5 that's why i'm click here then connect to this pin like this okay because api value is save on percent as and field one value is save on second value okay if you use field 3 then you expand like and field 2 then percent f then you expand like this and connect to third input here field okay but i am using only field one that's why i'm enter here okay all done and you see there have a result string now click to his click to this and connect to this url okay this is the from url because the uh, output url is going to http then uh, open the chrome or open any http link then update our value okay now all complete control t okay now connect to your arduino okay okay now uh, first uh, first uh, sorry connect your arduino to your laptop okay now right click okay now connect it Okay, now refresh it click to refresh and connect to com3 okay and little change you can change from control here like uh, i am copy this control c and i am uh, delete this control b and right click on here and create a control like this this is our input okay now enter your api key okay increase their size like this this is our api key okay i am enter here api key api key okay now all complete this is our analog pin this is api key okay now uh, we need to uh, right click on here and create an indicator because the uh, voltage display on here also okay and the same value uh, update on cloud okay and the value is 0 to 5 voltage okay now uh, come to the hardware okay uh, there has small problem and uh, the problem is that right click on here and drag it like this okay now control t okay okay and the small thing is right click on here come to timing and wait drag here and enter a five second delay like constant uh, constant and 5000 it means 500 sorry five second delay okay now uh, click to run okay now click to run okay the value is zero okay when i change the terminal like this is uh, right now is ground I am change and connect to 5 voltage that is 5 voltage 
connect to 5 voltage okay and you see in the uh, lab view there are 5 voltage okay now check for in the in our cloud what's going on here now uh, come to cloud and you see the value is 0 but after few seconds it's update like 20 second okay after 20 seconds uh, update 5 you see okay now let's change it okay uh, now let's change okay now you see the value is 5 and same value is here you see 5 voltage okay now you uh, in the hardware you see now I'm uh, replaced to 3 voltage now I'm connect terminal to 3 voltage okay and you see uh, in the lab view after a few second or a 5 second it's update okay okay because I enter a 500 that's why the value change oh sorry I already connect 5 voltage need to replace 3 voltage connect to 3 that is okay you see in the live view the value change like 3.3 .3. okay after 20 second or a 15 second it's update come to 3 volt okay you see here you see it's come down to 4.7 and after 3.7 3.3 okay let's see what's happening on here wait a few seconds because thing uh, speak loud take a few seconds for update you see 3.38 it's same on here okay now you see in the hardware i'm connect to ground ground is zero let's check it now i connect to pin ground and you see live view zero okay after a few seconds it's come to zero it's a 3.37 but after a few seconds okay let's need to wait okay because after a few seconds let's update like take a 15 second maybe 15 second or 20 you see now is zero value okay it's fully work ultimately update the value from cloud okay now you see i'm last time i'm update click to 5 voltage you see this is a 5 voltage i'm connect to 5 voltage okay and you see in the arduino lab view 5 voltage and you see they have 1 volt okay after a few seconds update okay we need to uh, take it okay you see 5.01 same value here it's ultimately project we need to transfer in data like temperature humidity or like smoke anything we can update it okay guys first of all uh, thanks a lot and if you like this video please subscribe our channel and share with your friends thanks a lot guys